Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. If you're returning, thank you. And if you're a Hell's Bell, hello. Um, I hope you're all well. Um, we've still got this beautiful weather here in the UK. I'm not, I think it's nationwide, I'm not sure. But um, here on the South Coast, it's absolutely scorching. And um, it's hilarious, really, because the dog walker said, um, oh, can I take Dolly out really early because of the heat? And I was like, yeah, of course. And, um, cause I, you know, I really don't mind when she goes out if I haven't got anything on really in that day. But if I'm going to be out all day, then I prefer to be walked in the middle of the day. But I mean, Dolly is lying out there right now in the full sunshine, which is hilarious, isn't it, really? So she, the whole house is cool, but no, she's lying in the full sunshine. So I'm not sure that the heat is really a problem for her. But anyway, I've got my glasses on today because um, the optician told me off of wearing my lenses too much. I never used to wear contact lenses at all um, once I started wearing the very focals. But now that I do, I love them and I wear them virtually every day. But he told me I've got to have one day a week off. Um, so today's that day so i thought well you know what it's not the end of the world is it and these are the ones that react to light so when i i've got a load of jobs to do this morning and then once i've done those i get to sit out in the sunshine for a little while um and try and relax but i can't do that if i know that there's things need doing in the house i think we're all the same aren't we when i was younger i used to say like sod it i'm going out in the garden because the jobs will still be there but old age has got the better of me now so um yeah i today it's a little bit i've i've got um i haven't opened them yet so you know i try and buy one piece of cashmere um knitwear every summer uh, every summer every winter for every winter and i trawl the sales for those and um i've ordered a couple of pair a couple of sweaters off um next i did order one from john lewis honest to god it was supposed to be an extra large it was about this big so i think that was from a fancy brand F fancy brands <laughs> like to make you feel fatter i don't think they want us in their demographic anyway um i've got three from next i say no idea haven't even opened the bags yet so i'll pop those on and then i always feel like a bit like confession um Moder and Pelly kept sending me, you know, last of the sale, last of the sale. So I've also got three, um, I can't remember what they are, three items of footwear from Moder and Pelly, which equally I haven't opened the bags. So um, that's what I'm showing you today. Um, no idea how it's going to be, like, a, you know, a disaster or a hit, but we will see. And uh, as usual, I'm gonna to have to do the shenanigans where I, I sit on a stool to show you the shoes because um, I still haven't, I mean, cause obviously you wanna see them quite close up, don't you? So there's no point me just wearing them. Um, like as in, you know, when I normally stand back there with the fashion on, fashion <laughs> clothes. Um, yeah, so I'll sit on the stool and I'll show you them and then I'll sit on the stool and show you them on my feet. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything else really. As usual, you know, thank you for all the support. It's lovely. And um, the sewing one went down well. I do feel like a bit of a fraud really because I really am not that good. So, um, yeah, I know a little bit about a lot of things, but I don't know a lot about a few things does that make sense anyway gobbling on as usual i will get on now i'll do the sweaters jumpers whatever first the knitwear first and um see how that goes and then i'll do the shoes <laughs> fingers crossed this first one is a poncho and this is in the next sale it's 50 percent wool and cashmere and uh, it was just 30 pounds which is pretty good all things considered now i don't think it's for me and i'll show you why it is literally a poncho it's just a rectangle with um a hole for your neck um but i think when you've got a bust 
like I do. I think it kind of just hangs down from there. I mean, if I was like traveling on the tube regularly or stuff like, you know, the underground, then I think it would be nice to put over something, you know, to give you that layer of warmth. Um, but, you know, I have to be sensible about this stuff. It's very tempting. It's really lovely and soft. It's, you know, it's a nice piece of um, knitwear, really. I mean, you could, I suppose you could catch it there, but you still, yeah, I mean, you know what? It was worth a go, but I don't think I need it because I'm more of a jacket kind of a person. I'm not really a poncho kind of a person. Um, but for 30 quid, it, it looks a lot more than that and it is lovely and warm. So, you know, I'm just showing you there's some bargains still to be had on the next clearance. As I've told you before, if you go along the top of the tabs where you've got women, children, blah, 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 there's um, clearance and you just can search on cashmere, women, sizes, whatever, to filter it down. And um, that's how I find this stuff. So um, I'll go and try the next jumper on. This is perfect. This is, um, it's expensive, it's 130 pound, but this is 100% cashmere, a beautiful blue. Like, I love it. And a lot of last year I spent in the deep winter trying to find something like this, couldn't find it. I love this long ribbed cuff. Um, you know, you can turn it back or you can keep it down longer if it's really chilly. It's got this nice roll neck, which I folded in that way, which is more flattering. Doesn't fight with my um, skin. It's got a dolman sleeve. Now for me, this is exactly what I was looking for. So whilst it's expensive, it is half price. So it's um, hand wash, but I'll do that in the machine. It's a good length, comes down, covers my backside, covers everything. It's just for me, this is exactly what I've been looking for. And I know it's a lot of money, obviously, but this is an investment piece. I will look after this. The colour I know suits me, it's one of my favourite colours. And um, yeah, I'm really happy I found this one. So um, that's a winner. I'm really pleased with this, can you tell? I mean, I should just add that, you know, in the not the sale, John Lewis and M&S, Marks and Spencer, they're, they're um, Cashmere runs at about £110 and it is not this, it's not this quality. This is a really good weight of, of cashmere. Um, it ticks every single box. This is in extra large and yeah, it's a winner. It's a keeper. Now this third one from Next, also in the clearance, this is £110 and this is also 100% cashmere. And um, it's cute, but the one thing in the clearance is you only get one photograph and that is just the square front facing photograph of the garment or whatever picture they've used in the catalog to show that garment. And um, what it doesn't show you is this. Now I don't have a problem with that per se, but it's not what I was expecting. So it reminds me of those, you know, those comedians that used to do the half the face thing. So this is a much neater fitting jumper and one that I would, you know, struggle more with what I'm wearing on the bottom. I would only wear this really with um, a skirt or, or kind of black trousers. That would be it. So this has much less scope for me, although it's a perfectly nice sweater and it's... Um, a bit different and you know you have got that kind of surprise element at the back do feel a bit like um dominoes but uh yeah absolutely nothing wrong with it but the blue one is an absolute winner and so these other two pieces will be going back
got a nice neckline. You know, there is absolutely nothing wrong with this. But when I'm spending that kind of money, which is high end, although it's half price, at least half price, um, it has to tick more than one box. And um, the blue one ticks all the boxes because I could wear that with skirts, jeans, trousers, whatever. Yeah, so um, that's the three pieces of cashmere. And um, next it will be the shoes that, as I have said, I cannot remember what I've even ordered. So you can join me with that surprise. So the first pair is this pair of sandals. Um, I have to say they're as light as a feather and um, there's no paperwork. I've just realized, I'm just gonna, oh no, there is, hang on. So how much were they? These are called Palmers and they've got no, no price on here. So I'm gonna have to get my order. They um, are 69 pounds, but I did have a 20% discount code. So, um, well, you can work that out, but they are out of stock, I've just seen, but I'll try them on anyway and see if they are fabulous. I don't think they will be because it's quite narrow um, here and um, I haven't got the nicest toes. So let's see. I've got my shorts on because it's so hot. But um, I'll turn the light off. They are as light as a feather and as comfortable as slippers. Damn. I didn't really want to like them. Um, excuse the state of my legs, I haven't put leg makeup on or anything. Um, just au naturel. And this pair um, was 36 pounds, but again, I got 20% off. Now I really don't need these, but I thought they're a great nude color and not too high a heel. So if they are fabulous, then we'll see, but they have to be Fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. <laughs> if um, I was to think of keeping them. So I'll try those on now and we can have a look. They are a really good new shoe, but they are not as comfortable as um, the ones I've got, you know, that are kind of the metallic pink. So whilst these are a fabulous option for a nude sandal, you know, I have to remember my life and um, I don't need them. So they can go back, even though they are a bargain of bargains because they're coming in at under 30 pounds and they would have been 90 pounds originally. So, um, but you know, there's still money, isn't it? So uh, they're going back. And then there's just one last pair to show you. Now this pair is a little bit more off the wall, but I thought I'd give them a go. Now these were, how much were they? Um, 47 pounds. Don't know if they've still got them. Again, they had 20% um, off. And yeah, they're still in stock um, in some sizes. So they were 47, reduced from 95, plus their 20% discount. Now these might be ridiculous. I don't know, but I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna try them because I'm getting the delivery anyway. I've just noticed they haven't got any elastic on there, which might be a bit of a problem, but Although they look really high, in actual fact, because of the um, the platform, they're not really, they're only kind of that high, aren't they? So you're not at a terrible angle, but they might be ludicrous. They might be the best thing since sliced bread, but there's only one way to find out. So I'll do that now. I don't know. I really like them. They're comfortable. They give me height without the steep thing. They're like a flat form, really. 
They're as light as a feather. Um, I don't know. I'll get Katie to give me a reality check and Grace to I'll, I'll send them the video and let them see what they think. But uh, I really like them. So, you know, I often think, what would I think if I saw a lady like me wearing these? And I think I'd think, good on you, you know. I don't know, it's hard, isn't it? I have all kinds of um, conversations going on in my head with these now. And you know what, I'll be honest, it's mostly other people's opinions because I think, I think whether people will think um, you're too old, you're too fat, who do you think you are, all of that stuff. And then I have the other conversation, the, 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 noise, the voices saying, oh, look at you, good for you, they look nice, blah, 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 blah. Why is that? Why can't I just think, what do I think? I like them. Um, but I will take on board what my daughters say because I know that there's no, um, oh, well, I trust their opinion is basically what it is. But I think they're really fun. And you know, they give me the height, which helps, doesn't it? With elongating and everything. And it also, I think, lets, lets people know that you're still know what it's about, whatever that means. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. So anyway, on that very strange finale, I will say goodbye and I'll see you really soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.